Giving the terminally ill the choice of when to die was always going to be a divisive issue. I urge you to vote in favour of that. Um, we will not be harassing, but we will be sure as shit lobbying. Emotions ran high as a motion was carried. All those in favour say aye. Aye! Urging all Labor MPs to support voluntary assisted dying laws through a conscience vote in September. But Logan MP Linus Power expressed reservations about legalising the scheme. I want a law that honours all Queenslanders, honours their life, their struggle, their death. We can then enhance that honour, but upon a careful examination of this legislation, I believe it's not the way. Impassioned party members were the ideal audience as the government ramped up its budget sell. My government will be investing $1.84 billion to turbocharge Queensland jobs in this state. It will include $350 million of new money to expand industries like biomedicine. This medical research facility in Brisbane will get a $20 million slice of the funds to manufacture vaccines locally within the next decade. At the moment, we have to go overseas for that. Now, in the future, we'll be able to do it here in Queensland. If there's one thing uh, COVID has taught us, it's taught us this. We need to make more things in Queensland, by Queenslanders, for Queenslanders. The budget will be handed down in nine days. Rachel Riga, ABC News, Brisbane.